I'm Jay. I'm the gen general manager for the Sign Enterprise Group of companies here in Fredericksburg. We're a second chance employer. Um, I had the unfortunate uh, privilege of having a 20 month vacation courtesy of Virginia DOC a few years back. Um, earlier this spring, I spoke to Juanita, thought I'd check out this organization a little bit. She roped me in and now I can't quite get away. <laughs> um, so I lead the, uh, on Tuesday nights, I lead the Courage to Change program. And it's an evidence-based uh, program that we've purchased. Um, it's written a lot from a supervisory role of, of a probation officer slash case manager. Um, we take that out, turn it into a mentorship program, adapt it to our own needs, make it something fun. Um, our goal is for it to be a constant interactive mentor slash group discussion slash journaling experience where folks can come in once a week and decompress and dump in this program and hopefully come out with some extra courage to change. Um, it's, we're only coming up on really week, week two, but really week one, last week was more introductory. This week will be the first week of really getting into the curriculum. And to expand on what Lena said, it's crazy successful on the inside of the jail. Um, we had a gentleman, our class runs on Tuesday evening, we had a fella get out from RJ Tuesday morning, yeah. one of Teresa's <laughs> students, um, brought the office staff lunch from his food truck for lunch, and then came to class Tuesday night yeah. on fire to get involved. Wow. Um, yeah. So it's good stuff, and I'm just following what Lou and Teresa and others have, have gotten started, so it's pretty cool. Um, the nine subjects are things like getting started, substance abuse, Peer relationships, seeking employment. Um, help me out, Lou. A couple others. Mm -hmm. um, <laughs> responsible thinking, social yeah. values. Social values, yeah. Family ties. Family ties, yeah. So, so those are the topics. They're five weeks per nine segments, I guess you would say. Um, folks that complete that 45 week program will get a certificate, be inducted into Hall of Change, um, and get letters of reference probably for second chance employment or second chance housing or by that point we've developed a really good rapport with them we have a good relationship we don't mind vouching for their completion and their progress um, perfect volunteer help for me would be uh, probably two things we had nine people last week we'll have 14 tomorrow <laughs> um, so I don't know how that number will continue to go but I could definitely probably use a second set of hands even just sometimes um, and the other thing is right now we're split 12 and 2 men to women um, I'm not so naive to think that this problem is limited to males That's right. so if we know of females in the community that could benefit from or need this service refer them and then the back side of that is I would love to have a female helper at some point uh, because there will be some opportunities for one-on-one -on -one mentorship and counseling. Not that I can't do that, that's not always gonna be appropriate, so. All right.